What is good everybody? It is your boy Super Saiyan Cat back with another video for you guys today. We have something that I honestly thought I would never see on Xenoverse period. Xenoverse 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I never thought I would see something like this on the game for PS4 or Xbox. Not PC, PS4. But before we get into this video guys talking about this hacker, I want to give two huge major shout outs. First one is to my homie Nagoy because that's the person who I got this footage from like he's the one uh, he made a video about it and that's where I initially learned about it from and then I saw this and I downloaded his video to make this and also give a shout out to Ruruka22 because obviously the original original footage came from him as you see his gamer tag being Hercule and all that. So again, two huge major shout outs to both of those guys. I'll have both of them linked down below in the description. Be sure to check out their channel and subscribe if you do enjoy their content. Now, one other thing I want to say before we get this video started, the reason I have not had any gameplay, like I, I meant to have a Bardock gameplay video for you guys online and another Xenoverse 2 rank vid with a new CAC that I've been meaning to break out as well. But my router is like, it, it's dying on me, literally. It's at the end of its life. And it's just everything I do, every game I play is laggy to the point where I really have not been able to record. So I just wanted to mention that. I do apologize for it, but I will get it fixed as soon as possible. But that's enough talking for me. Let's get into this footage of this hacker. Now, I haven't seen the whole video. I've seen parts of it, seen the moves that he uses and things like that. But I have not seen the whole video. I will say that. So let's see what this has to offer in total. But as you see, he starts off with the Darkness Mixer. Darkness Mixer is the move for all the evil versions of characters where you get your stamina and key back. No CAC is supposed to be able to have that. Only the evil characters or the raid bosses are supposed to be able to have that. That's example number one of the nonsense that this man pulls off. Now there is much more as you guys will see. Now it seems to me like he's just spamming a lot of Sudden Storm right here, continuously using the Darkness Mixer to get- Look at his stamina. Do you see how much his stamina is increasing while he's using that? Like, it, it's just absolute nonsense. Now, he has another thing that, another raid boss move, which will you will see in a quick second, that is absolutely insane, guys. And that's really the one that is mind-blowing to me. Like, it just does not make sense. How did this man do this? How do you hack PS4 to get these type of things? It's like he modded PS4. That's truly what it seems like he did with this, with it. This, this is what I'm talking about right here. Huh? That is a specific raid boss only move no characters in the game have it darkness mixer is available for some of the evil characters that right there is exclusive to only only the raid bosses but somehow this man has it not not like what it, it, I don't know how, as you see, I'm lost for words right here just by the the, the, the the utter disgust, I guess you could say, the fact that somebody's actually doing this in, in, on Xenoverse. Like, there's already enough cheat. Look at this, man. Look at this. Look at this. Like, you, you can do anything. You can literally, you can use it while your stamina broken getting hit. That's how OP this is. That, what, oh, what joy do you get, honestly? Like, what joy can a person get from this? It is a question that I've always wondered like cheesing in general, but this is to a whole nother level What joy can you get you're literally like wasting time on a game because it's not like you're getting good What what are you doing really you're just is it enjoyable to just win by cheap tactics to buy by pressing two buttons R2 and X or whatever He has the skill set on is that really fun? I, I've never understood it But the, the main purpose of this video guys is to show this to you guys so you can see it firsthand so you also can see who this guy is. So if you do run into him on PS4, you don't waste your time and end up raging like crazy. Because I promise you, for the most part, anybody who sees this is going to rage because of how shocking it truly is. Like your jaw will literally drop when you first play this man and he hits you with that raid boss move. You're going to be like, what the hell? Like, like Nani? Did he really just do that? And then you're going to realize that he did. Now watch this right here. This part I did see in the video still. Watch, look at this nonsense. Do you see that? That This is the part where I cut the video out the first time around when I watched it. That is absolutely like he was about to die. Super Conley, I'm about to kill this man. But you are literally able to use that move. Like it's like an unlimited OP limit burst. That's what I see it as. 
because it's it's a limit burst with the move basically because limit burst how you can use it during your stamina to save yourself i mean during your stamina break to save yourself it seems you can do the same thing with that move right there now only this guy right here has been the only one shown with it i haven't seen any other people oh my do you see this man's record what hold he was thirty thousand and twenty two. favorite move favorite move dark mix mixer and favorite finisher marbling drop what the fuck so basically his two most common used moves are the two moves that he cheated to get and he hacked the game for like i would hope i don't i don't know how you got 22 losses bro to be honest like how do you lose period with, with, unless it was like with friends or something and, and they had the shit too but I, I don't see how you can lose with this like is it possible really but but again guys the main purpose of this video was to put this out there so everybody can see it so a lot of others can see it so if you guys run into this guy online again you don't have to deal with it you can just back out the lobby or kick him from your lobby so you just don't end up raging for no reason like there's literally no reason to fight this guy even if you do beat him i mean what's the point in that it's it's just a w it's not like you get crowned or something for beating this hacker you really get nothing from it besides some rage that is most likely going to come your way because it's highly doubtful that you do beat this man based off the nonsense that he truly has but all in all really hope you guys enjoyed this video again huge shout out to ruruka22 and the homie big boy nagoy both of their channels will be down below in the description and just be sure again if you do end up fighting this guy just to see if you can win do not take it seriously afterwards if you do lose because that's most likely gonna happen you literally have like a 0.1 percent chance of winning again do not take it to heart it's absolute nonsense as you guys see and as i've said many times in this video but all in all again thank you guys for watching really hope you guys enjoyed this video and when i get my connection working right again i definitely will have those gameplay videos up for you guys as soon as possible again but till next time and okay messed up the outro out there as always thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed until next time i hope you guys have a good day hey shall we got it right there